What's up guys, it's that Panda again. I'm here again with another video and today we're just going to be talking a bit about the new armament lotto, okay? And it replaced the survival challenges thing, which I honestly wouldn't have had an issue with this event in general. I would have liked if they didn't, um, like the thing is that that made this like as bad as it is or like the complaints as bad as they were is that they removed, um, the the coins that you already saved up right whereas like if you let's say if if you hit like this rank right you would get a coin that would allow you to hit the rank again or if you collected five of them you could hit the rank again right and you could get them in both of these uh kind of sections and you could kind of save them up so that kind of pissed a lot of people off which i i would say rightfully so you know what i mean especially if people were saving up for the uh, the gold one which would have taken a lot more time would have you know kind of costed you potential money which kind of sucks right like I, I think like like it just sucks that they never tell you when they're doing these updates they never compensate you in any way they never do any of that um i didn't like that they removed the that it's like a, the daily quest and they made it these challenges i kind of preferred the daily quest they were pretty easy for me to complete i'm not going to complain about that though either way um it's mostly the same. They also removed the, the, the gifting thing where you could uh, kind of discount it, right? You would be able to cut off a few dollars. Um, like, let's say you would cut off a dollar here. You would buy this $5. You would save both of you $1 combined, right? And it was the same here. You would save yourself like yourselves $4 or something like that. And that was a really nice feature. And they removed that as well, made it back to singular, which I just think it's a little bit annoying that they changed it up without like any notice. You know, it's just annoying when they do stuff like this. But either way, I don't think there's anything wrong with the event the only issue is that the event was how it was and they just suddenly freaking like freaking curb stomped us right like they just screwed us over okay either way uh let's go to the draw prizes i don't actually have a problem with this i think like at the end of the day like i've said it before but ig is a business right like i i expect them completely to do stuff like this especially something like this it's not like it's hurting me i mean i guess it's indirectly hurting me because it's going to help people get stronger which as a result will hurt me um if i don't spend myself which i'm not spending on this right like i'm just not going to spend on it realistically it's it's a gamble and I, I really spend in the first place and i'm not going to spend on something that's going to like kind of be a gambler's dream right Either way, we can kind of look at this. Um, uh, the thing is, this this thing progressively goes up. I don't know the exact price, like, you know, how, how it jumps. But I'm going to be guessing it's something like uh, from $5 to, like, maybe, uh, sorry, $1 to $5 to maybe either $10 or $20. After that, maybe around $50, something like that. And then it jumps all the way up to 100 eventually. And from what it looks like, I got a screenshot from someone, and it was a uh, $100 pack, and you get 100 of these, like, little ticket things, right? And, you know, the worst thing I think about this pack is that there are no gyms. And you could, you could argue that, well... Uh, Panda, you're you're pulling armaments and stuff at the end of the day. Like, uh, it's kind of worth the trade-off. And I would agree if your pool rates were better, right? But I know some people have spent hundreds, right? And and I mean, obviously, they, I don't think they've spent all their tickets yet, but they spent hundreds, right? And they were drawing, 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 and I'm sure they burned through at least a hundred dollars or even two hundred dollars in some cases without getting this super pool, which is kind of insane i mean maybe i'm wrong there uh maybe maybe i'm like overestimating the bad luck or something but it just looks like it's it's not that worth it if you're not pulling supers right and the supers obviously give you like an armament piece i just think like the drop off on losing like um 30k plus gems and um, without even getting like an actual armament i guess you can still get the fragments but your luck still has to be pretty good since these are like um I wouldn't say they're like super low draw rates, but you know, for 3% draw rates, basically, these are the best of chances. I mean, I guess it's over 10% across, but I just wouldn't like, I wouldn't put my luck in this thing. I don't know. I don't really like gambling stuff, um, especially in this game. Like, I, I feel like the rates are so scuffed and they never put the, like, they, they didn't even put the super chances in here. I'm guessing there's like, um, maybe it improves as you keep drawing or something. I don't really understand. I don't really get what the circle's for either. I think it's just like, I don't know. Maybe it's just a design. It's just weird. I, I don't know. I I don't I don't hate it. I think like if people want to spend on this, they'll spend on it. That's up to them. I mean, I would say the one thing that annoys me is how much this thing flashes across your screen. It's like the uh, whenever somebody wins these like lucky pools, it'll flash across your screen. It's like, dude, it's one thing for people to awaken here on my region or to, um win a 10 times on roulette in my region for a hero and it flashes across my screen but i do not want to see every single region where people are winning stuff flashing across my screen i don't need the ego flex okay i don't need it across my screen i don't know that's just a little bit annoying to me i find it uh just to be kind of 
ticks me off a little bit. Either way, you guys give me your thoughts, okay? I do appreciate you guys always for watching. You guys give me your thoughts on this. If you're angry about the sudden update, the change or whatever, like like I said, I don't think the event itself is bad. I think the event's just fine. I think the biggest issue is that they had this other event and then they just screwed us over. They didn't alert us. They just took our coins. Um, I mean, if they were going to do that, at least give us free lotto stuff, right? For the coins we had. Maybe give us like two lotto things for every coin we had or something like that it's just a little bit annoying that they screwed us over like that especially people who maybe were saving it up because it's like imagine you had 10 of those coins right that's ten dollars right or, actually never mind I'm, I'm stupid that's like six dollars right there right that could get you two of these um that could that could get you two of these passes it's just a little bit annoying and i don't know i'm not going to keep pandering on, on about the subject you guys have a good day or night um comment down below and yeah you guys have, have a good one peace out